hey y'all, it's your girl JJ, and I'm today with another video for you guys. And today, as you can see by the title, it is day one of Vlogtober. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post another banger video. And for today's video, I have a special guest with me. Hi. <laughs> My YouTube is Princess K TV. Yeah. So, yeah. So, today's, for, for today's video, we're going to be doing making lip gloss because as you can see by her shirt we have a lip gloss business called the lip drip which i promoted in my Shein haul if you didn't go watch that go watch that before you watch this video or watch it after so yeah we're going to be showing you how to make lip gloss the correct way for people who just now started the business because we have started her we had this business for a while now so we basically pros at it so we're about to be showing you how to make lip oil lip scrub whatever you need the first thing you ever need in this thing is sanitize. Glove. That's it's the first step. Step one is sanitize. Yeah. Wear gloves. No, you don't first have wash your hands, like put sanitizer, because you know it's corona too. Not everybody have gloves or can afford gloves. So if you don't have gloves or can afford gloves, just, just make sure you wash your hands, hands. then sanitize, put sanitizer, sanitizer on. Yeah. But we have gloves, so we're still gonna wash our hands, but we're gonna put the gloves still on. So yeah, we about to go show y'all that. So before we get any further, I just wanted to say that it's the reason why we was doing it in the kitchen on the floor is because um she just got her table waxed, so we didn't want to scratch the table or put any um, lip gloss on the table because the table, like lip gloss, is really sticky, so we didn't want to mess that table up. So we just had to do something else, and that's what we came up with. It don't look that bad. It was still sanitized and everything, but we usually do it on the table. So y'all don't mind her. This is our little like. Um, thing like set up over here. We still got some more stuff over there, but the camera's not showing it because that's all the way over there. But um, yeah, we already made our first batch with the wand tubes, so I'm about to show y'all that. And we making a little bit more squeeze tubes. We making the colors pink delicious and minty breeze and mixed. So this is the mixed one and the wand tube and a wand tube. <laughs> and this is a minty breeze and a wand tube. And this is a pink delicious by itself in the wand tube. So yeah, we just made wand tubes right now. And so now we're making oh, yeah, squeeze. Oh, we're making squeeze tube. This is mixed, and then we didn't make a minty breeze by itself in the wand tube yet. I mean, in a squeeze tube. And right now I'm making fairy dust. So we forgot to um, we forgot to record the part when we made the wand tubes and the squeeze tube. So I'm about to show y'all how to make. What color am I making? You can make. You want to make another. You want to make another blue or pink. I'm gonna tell you what you do. Make any color, but it's not purple. All right. I'm gonna make. Um. Like, wait, what color can we get? I'm gonna make purple. I just say, but not purple. Oh. I'll make. What color? Make the um. The very the very I'll make um protest protest flower. I don't know where butterflies at. So what you want to make? Make the rose petal one. Oh, okay. With the, um, clear? Mm hmm So I'm not cool. Go make clear! Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> but I want to make something that they showed them how to put pigment in it. But I'm going to do the rose petal. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need a cup. Oh, no, you don't need a cup. You need anything that you can mix in. So like a bowl. You don't want a plate because you don't want your stuff spilling everywhere. And I feel like a plate doesn't absorb everything. Like you're going to have to scoop some stuff in there. So I recommend, I recommend you use a cup or a bowl. And we're using a cup because we don't want too much mess. So we're using a cup. Use a plastic cup. Use something that you can like put in the trash after. You don't want something that you can reuse because lip gloss is really messy. So yeah. Can I get a tooth? Me? What tooth? I need a squeeze tooth. Squeeze two for here. Yeah, I want to okay. So this is her filled it up, so I'm gonna show you how to fill it up. Alright, the snake is gonna go to the top. To the fairy dust right here. <laughs> but yeah. I'm about to put that right there. So the brand, if you're wondering what brand we use, we use no problem llama. No. no. We use no problem llama. <laughs> This is the pack. This is the 12 OZ pack. We don't usually get this pack. We usually get the bigger pack. But today we're just gonna be working with this. It really looks the same to me, but it don't matter which one you use. But I realize I recommend you use the No Papa Mama one. I'm about to put the lip gloss base inside this cup. He messed up already. 
I'm editing all this out. And I'm saying you messed up already. Huh? Because you put the end away first. <laughs> oh, I don't want to show them how to make it correctly. In case that they, if they watch it. Because you know they won't watch it for sure. Right, so why don't I say I, this? I'm going to post up my story. Because mm. we can't really show everything that we got. So now when you got your lip gloss base inside your cup or your bowl, wherever you want it to be, you're going to take your oil, any oil you use, we use grapeseed oil. Oh, I'll make it clear. So I'm only going to add a little bit of oil because if you have green, this is green oil, so if you have green oil, you don't want to add too much to it. Because this is me testing the lip gloss out. But y'all don't get it. Oh yeah, I'm about to show you what our lip gloss looks like. We have an Instagram page. The Instagram page will be in the bio. You can barely see it. I gotta come closer. I'm gonna just add a little bit because I don't want it to turn green. Because we had problems like that happen before. Like if you're not a um if you're not a um patient person, then lip gloss making is not for you. You have to be a very organized and patient person because it does take patient and organization. Oh, yeah, I better told out in the beginning. Oh, yeah. So this is the lip gloss. All right, so now I'm going to add um, the rose petals. So can you pass me the rose petals? This is the rose petals we use. We're not... I don't know where we got these little petals from because she bought them. But y'all need to know where to get that from. Because you can really get it from anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> you know my business? Yeah, don't, don't do that. that. <laughs> Psych though, but you can really get this from anywhere. We got this from Alibaba. <laughs> Who's Alibaba? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Somebody go look that up. Alright, so we got to be this from Etsy. This test too. But, yeah, so. Let's chop these up because you don't want this, like, stuck, get stuck yeah, in you know. it. Ziploc bag. We use a Ziploc bag. But, I don't know how y'all gonna do it. Y'all gonna use a shop right bag. Y'all can do it, <laughs> like, get as much as you want to. But, we gonna keep it professional. As we always do. And we're going to take a zip-up bag. We're going to put the lip gloss in the zip-up bag. So I'm going to, like, if you like piping the cake. So I'm about to get back to y'all. So I'm done throwing it up. And what you're going to do is you're going to squeeze all that down. Just like that. You're going to squeeze it all the way down. Just okay, so y'all, don't be done by me. Add the set. Okay, so add it real quick. I'm just going to like. Forgot what part we stopped at, but right now we're just disinfecting the um. Uh, just disinfecting the um lip glosses and the scissors because they all sticky. So um, we got the wrong shoes and the squeeze tube all in there. But I think I'm just going to explain what happened. So we ran out of storage, but basically what you do is you just put the lip gloss inside the Ziploc bag. And then you cut the like the tip of the zipper bag like you pipe in the um cake and then you just put that inside the syringe and then you use the syringe and you put the lip gloss from the syringe inside the lip gloss and then you just put the lip gloss together. And then after that you go to this part which is disinfecting. Then after you disinfect it you package it however you want to. 